So, um, in college, what grade did I start playing football in college, or what grade did I start playing football? Well, in college, like what grade? Oh, so yeah, I was a freshman. Um, I didn't, I didn't red shirt. I started playing mainly um, special teams and uh, nickelback. Eleven forty-eight left to play. So, what do you like most about football that just makes you want to keep on well, um, I liked different things about it. I liked that I was able to be just a boy. Go out and tackle somebody, take them to the ground without getting in trouble. Um, you know, I, I liked to be able to run fast and, um, you know, get the ball in my hands and take the ball away from people. I just liked the game. Um, so those, those things. When you were younger, what got you initially into football? Like, who who got you to play the sport, or did you just want to play? Bella, that's a great question. <laughs> because I have a great answer for that. So, um, I started off running track. Okay, this is a short version. I started off running track. I begged my dad for about two years to play football. I started begging him around eight, about eight, and uh, he finally signed me up when I was 10 years old. And the way he did it was a surprise. He came home from work and he had a pair of cleats in the back seat of his car. And he told me, he came in the house and he told me to go outside and check the back seat of the car. And I didn't know why, but I went out there and there was some cleats. Uh, if I would have, if I named the cleat, you wouldn't even Martin, know the name. Looking for Marshall Falk, out of his hands, Jason Webster. I was so excited because I knew what they meant. So in the end put zone, the and shirt on and put the t-shirt and shirt on and put the t-shirt on. My dad actually signed me up after two years. 11.48 left to play. Mm -hmm. So would you consider your dad your biggest influence? Uh, as it relates to football and I guess, you can do it there. Quickly. Yeah. 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 Is he one of your biggest supporters too? Yes, absolutely, 100%. My dad showed up. He was at every practice that I can think of, and he was definitely at every game and every track meet, and I could hear him um, after the game, definitely. What was your best game that you played so far? Hmm. From high school all the way to the pros? Yes. <laughs> or just the pro league? Just the pro league? Let's see, the best game. I, can I answer this? I, I answer it this way, Bella, okay? The most fulfilling game was my last game with the San Francisco 49ers. And the reason that was the most fulfilling game or the best game is because uh, I left on a good note. I left the team on a good note. And um, I think I finally kind of realized my potential that game. You know, the fourth game, that was my fourth season in the NFL. It took me four years to finally realize my potential. So that game was a few minutes. What the was that, man? <laughs> <laughs> uh, you know, nowadays, guys playing the touchdown dances and all that, that was just so unplanned. That was, that was strictly emotional, strictly uh, off the cuff. But yeah, no, it wasn't that game. It was my last game. You know, I had one interception, didn't take any to the house, but um, I had a couple of pass breakups and I wasn't even supposed to be playing that much in that game. So uh, that's that's the most memorable game as it relates to best. If you could say who was your favorite coach, who would it be? Mm. So that's very difficult 